Here at Kentucky Speedway, honored to be joined by George Lutz. You're the founder and the executive director of Honor and Remember. Good to meet you, sir. Thank you for your service for our country, first of all. Well, thank you. Thanks for the opportunity to share our vision. Well, what is your vision? Well, the Honor and Remember organization was created as a public reminder that there's a price for freedom in this country, that military men and women are out in the fight losing their lives for our freedom. And the Honor and Remember is a symbol, a national symbol of remembrance, recognizing that sacrifice and their families that are still left behind. Now tell me about the tie-in between you guys and uh, we're here at the NASCAR track, you got the NASCAR lanyard, what's the tie-in? Yeah, well NASCAR and Honor and Remember partnered because uh, NASCAR is a very patriotic organization, its fan base is some of the greatest patriots in the, in the country, and so they believed in our cause and what we were doing to honor these families and, and to remember publicly the, the names of those that have given their lives and believed it would be a good tie into what they were doing and honoring the troops, the active duty military and the veterans. And so we have found that that partnership has just been amazing to be able to bring this message and this visual of this flag and what we're doing to the nation in a very positive way. When you hear the phrase, uh, the American warrior, what does that mean to you? Well, the American warrior to me is a combination of all of those that are serving this country and giving of themselves, highly trained, to be able to take on a task that 99% of us can't do. And that is to protect the rest of us um, from any harm you know, from our enemies and to keep our freedom safe. And so those American warriors are those men and women in uniform that put their lives on the line for us every single day. You have some guests here today, some Gold, for, uh, Gold Star family members. Tell us about them and tell us about the, the typical person you bring to a track. Well, the Gold Star families are families that have lost a loved one as a casualty of war or as a result of serving. And part of our program with NASCAR is to bring these families who are not military connected themselves except through their loved one, to bring these families to the track and give them a VIP treatment, give them a special day just of enjoyment, entertainment, and to be a part of, of the process of what's going on, to give them something that you don't usually get. So we have been bringing Gold Star families to the tracks at races all over the country uh, to just give them a unique experience. It's wonderful. It's so selfless, and I'm sure so many people appreciate it. If our listeners and our viewers want to help you out in, in what you do to honor and remember, uh, what do they do? Well, our website is simply honorandremember.org, all spelled out, uh, honorandremember.org. We have a petition online that they could sign a petition in favor of the, have the flag itself and flying it all over this country. They can let uh, other, their family members know about the website, and they can fly the flag. You know, we have uh, flags flying all over this country in honor of those that have given all.